that would like to talk about the 8x8 LED matrix displays and how they can be used for displaying scroll messages and these are very important in daily life and various projects you have two types of displays that I'm going to be talking about the first one is the usual one we are going to be using four individual 8x8 matrix displays which are connected like this yeah these are connected one at a time then I have this one the newer version where all of them are connected using a PCB layout like this one so this one is more user friendly although when it comes to programming it gives people a lot of our time so I will talk about that in a separate video today I'm only going to talk about this one if you look at one of these displays you observe that you're having eight columns and eight rows of LEDs and are being connected to max 7219 IC this IC helps us to reduce the number of input and output pins that are going to be used for this display so here in this case we are only having five input or output pins but if you don't have this IC then you are going to be needing more pins because each of these rows and each columns you need to be catered for so observe here we are having the clock chip select data in ground and VCC and then the same pins are this side so this other side is going to be the one used to connect to the next display and here the main case for example if you if you have two we're having two of these here being connected so the major thing here is to know the data the data in here is going to be acting as the data out for this other display so just connect the corresponding pins of one display to the other display like that so each display has input and output so just connect those ones in and then you have a continuous display as observed before this is the simple sketch showing the setup where you have the four individual displays being connected as we had explained and then the other last display is connected to the Arduino board the code is very simple the only thing you take note of is that you should have the max matrix dot h and fvr pgh libraries so these libraries are the ones which control the scrolling of the 8x8 led display so the other sketch is simple maybe yeah this shows the pins the Arduino or they are connected to the display and this gives the number of displays in our case I'm using four yeah so you can if you're using two you put two if you're using three use three if you're using more than four you can add the number there and this is the text which is going to be scrolling is put here and the rest of the code is rather simple so you can check in the description below of the video then you can see the code where you can be able to get it from we are going to upload the code and see what is going to happen so you upload the code and see what's going now you see that the scrolling is taking place but the words are not very visible so you can use a simple screen here so that we can cut out that extra light so that you can be able to see our words properly and in my case I'm going to use this simple white paper to put here words are now more visible mm -hmm. 
get when I remove if you remove the screen the words are not over it very visible so when you put the screen you can see the words.